Hello everyone, I am Gabriele, welcome to my channel. It seems that humans are coming closer and closer uh, to the aisle in Evrima from what Punch Pocket posted. I mean, uh, it posted some pictures of the interiors of uh, human buildings. So humans are eventually coming for real. Now, it doesn't matter if they can only run or they have only one feature like snapping away. It, it, it doesn't matter, uh, they are coming in the aisle, in Evrima. Uh, hopefully by the end of this year, I am uh, a lot skeptical about that, but uh, you never know. By the way, let's go and check these uh, pictures this, uh, that Punch Bucket posted for us. This one is, uh, uh, it's, it's, we can check like an office in here, inside a bunker, where we have uh, a personal room on the left hand side, a very old computer, that's a very old computer by the way, where the Apollo engineering uh, name on it and a couple of number pads. These number pads may do, uh, I think, a lot of functions, but one of these functions might be uh, to lock and unlock possible doors, possible safety uh, rooms um, where you can be uh, safe from dinosaurs, from uh, the outside world. Or, uh, I don't know, probably they are a mean of communication from uh, uh, this area to uh, a very far away area from another s on the other side of the island. I don't see any interphone, by the way, but uh, it's gonna be cool. Any the usage of these number pads, if they work when humans are out, I doubt it. I mean, I'm sorry, I'm being super skeptical. I'm being super skeptical, but uh, nevertheless, humans in the aisle, a pretty cool feature. Hopefully, fingers crossed, developers will add a function uh, that uh, will uh, toggle on and off humans for private servers. Not all uh, players are actually fond of humans in the aisle. They just want dinosaurs. So a function for private servers to toggle on and off the usage of uh, such playables, which are humans, that is, or mercenaries for now, that is. Now, this is the interior, a personal room, I assume, uh, I guess, or probably it's just an emergency room to uh, heal certain uh, heart, uh, certain, uh, mm, certain open wounds, I don't know. I have no idea, but this is like a, a, an emergency bed and this looks like, well, this is a sink, nothing else to say, and a broken mirror. All of this it looks like pretty abandoned in a pretty uh, grim world without light, a dark, uh, a terror uh, world. And this inside, this instead, it is, I don't know, to me, it looks like uh, the continuous of that bunker, uh, an office, again, where uh, everyone can actually rest, gather in here, snipe from these little windows in here, you can snipe dinosaurs from far away. I don't know, it's just guesses. We have air conducts, uh, we have, uh, I don't know, locker, ro lockers, uh, plenty of things. And uh, the first slash last picture is a storage room in here. All of these interiors are pretty good, I like them. Uh, they give uh, away that idea of abandoned, or uh, used from time to time, but slash abandoned uh, bunkers that humans can actually uh, man in order to fight dinosaurs at a more advantageous position in case you are running from bunker to bunker and uh, you are breaking havoc with your fire guns, if you find any, because probably uh, you will, won't have any fire gun when you start. It's just assumption from what I read and from what I understood. Well, what are your thoughts on all of these uh, snapshots that uh, uh, Punch Bucket posted in the Isle official Discord? All the links in the description below, by the way. So, please let me know what you think of humans, of these interiors. To me, they look pretty cool. On these shelves, plenty of firearms slash ammunitions slash... Uh, blades, knives, I don't know, a lot of things, a lot of things in here, uh, or uh, possible stuff that you can use to craft, uh, I don't know, motorcycles or cars, well, parts of them at least, you can stuff them all on these shelves, I don't know, just ideas or just potable water, you never know. Well, uh, thank you all so much for watching, please let me know what you think of these pictures in the description, in uh, the comment section below, and have a great day or night wherever you are watching from. Bye-bye. Bye-bye-bye.